Hi, in this video, I will show you how to connect an LCD with a serial connector to an Arduino Uno. And I will also show you how to write a simple sketch to make an LCD output what you want. There are lots of videos showing how to connect an LCD to an Arduino, but I spent a long time trying to figure out how to connect an LCD that has a serial module connected to it. So here's the LCD that I will be using. It's a regular 16x2. And if I flip it, sorry, it will show you the serial module that's connected to it. There are four pins, the VCC, the, uh, sorry, the ground, the VCC, SDA, and SCL. And this blue one here is the potentiometer that allows you to adjust the brightness of the screen itself. As you notice, there's nothing written on the LCD screen here, in the back as well, and on the serial module as well. I spent some time trying to figure out what it, what it could be, and I found that it could either be a YW robot or YW robot compatible. And the reason why it took me a while to figure that out, uh, it's because I initially I used to connect the SDA and the SCL from the LCD to the TX and the RX on the Arduino, but that didn't work. It needs to be connected to the SDA and the SCL pins on the Arduino, but as you can see in here, you don't see nothing is written that tells you this is the SDA and this is the SCL pins. However, if you flip the Arduino, you see it's written in here, SDA and SCL. Once I saw this with the proper library and the code, I was able to make it work. So I'm going to show you how I, how I connected them. So I'm going to connect the ground using the black wire to the ground on the Arduino. The red wire to the VCC connected to the 5 volts on the Arduino. Green wire to the SDA on the LCD. To the SDA pin on the Arduino. And the yellow wire to the SCL onto the SCL pin on the Arduino. There you go. It's as simple as that. Now I'm going to load up my sketch. Write it up. And we'll get this working. All right. The two devices are now connected, so next step is to work on the sketch. But before we continue, first of all, we need to download the library that we need. The library can be found in this website in here. I'm going to try to put in the notes below, or I will email it to you if you request it. The file we are interested in is called liquidcrystal underscore v onezip Click on it to download it. Click on OK, and there we go. It's done. It's very fast. It's a .zip file. Open it, extract everything inside it, and what we get is this. Two folders, liquid crystal and underscore Mac OS X. Since I'm running Windows, it's this one that I'm interested in. We need to copy it into the Arduino libraries folder on the computer. On my computer, it happens to be in the C, Program Files, Arduino Libraries. Just before you copy it over, rename the old one to whatever you want. In my case, I called it Liquid Crystal Old. All right, so now I'm going to be bringing up the IDE to start working on the sketch. The object of this sketch is not to teach you how to write commands for the LCDs. It's only to verify whether or not the contraption we've done before works or not. So we start off by loading three libraries the wire.h, lcd.h, and the liquid crystal underscore i2c.h. And then we define those nine variables in here and this array in order to initialize the LCD. Now all of this is not something that I've created by myself. I just copied it off somebody else in order to make sure it works. All right, now we move on to the void setup and we start the normal process by defining that it's a 16 by two LCD. Then we turn on the backlights and move the cursor to the beginning of the LCD and say, ask it to print that it works. And then we move to the second row and we say, thank you. The void loop in here, it has to be present in order for the program to check. But since it's not a fancy program, it's just empty. There's nothing in it. Let's go ahead and verify that it works. Go 
good now let's go ahead and upload it to the Arduino and we're gonna go verify how does it look like on the actual LCD well there you go as you can see it's outputting it works then thank you with an exclamation mark so all is good again I did this video because I had a hard time finding information about how to connect a serial LCD to an Arduino and hopefully this information is going to be useful to somebody and if you've got any questions or comments do not hesitate to leave any comments below and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like it until next time stay safe